Welcome to Kibabi University in general and the Institute of Gender and Development Studies in particular. The institute is uh, run by three members of staff. The first one is the director of the Institute of Gender and Development Studies. The one speaking, Dr. Rispo Epopolu. We work with the coordinator, IGDS, or the, for the institute, Dr. Nabuire, Christine, and an administrative, an office administrator, Irene Ambani. The Institute of Gender and Development Studies, IGDS, was established in 2017 with Dr. George Ekisa as the founding director of the institute. The mission of the institute is to advocate, promote, protect, and evaluate gender equality through research, public education, policy development, collaborations, and linkages at local, national, regional, and international levels. The objectives of the institute include the following. Number one, advocate and promote gender equality and freedom from discrimination in accordance with Article 27 of the Constitution, Kenyan Constitution. Number two, promote development and implementation of the gender policies, which include gender mainstreaming policy, sexual harassment policy, and gender-based violence policy. Number three, we have promote multidisciplinary research on gender issues at the local, national, regional, and international levels. Number four, advocate and promote education of women and, and men at all levels. Number five, set up short courses, certificate and diploma programs on gender mainstreaming. Number six, advocate for mainstreaming of gender in all Kibab University programs. Number seven, establish systems and strategies that address students and staff's real issues, real life issues. Number eight, advocate for policies that promote reproductive health and well-being of women and families. Number nine, create collaborations and linkages at the local, national, regional, and international levels. And number 10, institute strategies for IGDS sustainability. And this could be through resource mobilization. Now, the, the institute or IGDS mandate is supported by the following legislation. Number one, the Constitution of Kenya 2010, the National Gender and Equality Commission Act number 15 of 2010. 2011. Number three, Access to Information Act number 31 of 2016. Kenya Information Commission Act revised 2012 of 1998. Procurement, Public Procurement and Asset Disposal number 33 of 2015. Number six, Protection Against Domestic Violence Act number 2015. Number seven, Persons with Disability Act number 14 of 2003 and the National Gender and Equality Commission 2019 to 2024 strategic plan. I wish once again at this juncture to welcome you to the Institute and come in for consultation or report any case of physical, psychological, or emotional abuse. You are all once again welcome to Kibab University. Thank you. <laughs>